guys, Awesome Nerdshow here. Today we're doing a special unboxing of the C2E2 box. Um, so this was done by Nerd Block, I believe. It's like the um, uh, Emerald, Emerald, City. Yeah, Emerald City one we did a couple months ago or whatever. Um, so this is done by Nerd Block and the Read Pop. That's what the whole, I can't see the thing right there, the whole like Read Pop name and stuff. So they do a whole bunch of convention ones. And of course, this is a special C2E2. So the um, Chicago uh, Comic Con and Entertainment Expo, Expo is what I believe it stands for. Um, so, don't know anything that's going to, well, I guess I do know. There's going to be a pop in here. Um, I don't know of what, but I, they just said there was going to be, like, a um, early, like, thing pop or something from something. Like I said, didn't say anything more, just, like, an early edition pop or something like that. So, let's see what we got inside of here. Um, okay, so I see the pop from the start, so I'll go ahead and open it, which... I do see what the whole early thing, but this is an old one we've seen for a while. So it's a Deadpool where he's in a suit. And so this has been on like uh, the back of boxes and stuff like that before. But I guess they've just never released it. It does have the um, early preview sticker thing there that they released to like comic book stores and stuff like a couple months or whatever um, before it's released out in public and stuff. So we have, um, I guess he doesn't really have a name or anything. It's just Deadpool in a suit. And he's got a finger pointed, like he wants you. Um, but that's all. And he's got his other hand out. So I don't know if this be like a mob Deadpool or just a I suit Deadpool. I think he wants you, the viewer, to watch more of our videos. Yes, I want you. I don't know. This could be like his. No, I guess not. I say it could be like when he got married. Maybe it's his suit from his dad or something. I don't know. Um, so that's kind of cool. I mean, it's Deadpool. I'm kind of over Deadpool by now as much stuff as they're doing on him but it's still cool that's because I was afraid it's gonna be from some like show or movie that I had absolutely no clue what it was so at least it was from something that I know um, so that was cool so now it looks like we have our shirt here for the box so of course C2E2 2017 Chicago Illinois and then it has like a little crest there with Chicago skyline there at the top then we of course have a TV a blam for comics so TV for shows um, swords and aliens, so sci-fi and probably like fantasy type stuff like that. So that's a pretty cool show. I like this a lot more than the uh, uh, Seattle one or the Emerald yeah, City. City. So that's cool. I like the blue too. Um, so what next? Um, so we'll save that one. So we have more of the little muscle characters and this time they're street fighters and these are um, uh, C2E2 exclusives. So it looks like we have um, we have Ken, I think uh, Zangief, or I forget what his name is. I think Zangief, and uh, I can't think of the guy's name. Uh, I don't know. The, like, boxer guy. Do you know? Balrog? Could be Balrog, yeah. And then the um, guy that had the stretchy arms. Like, Dulcim. Oh, that's his name? Yeah. Okay, I do see that. I don't know if you can see those in there. We may have to open these, because don't, you don't want to collect these or anything. Yes, no. Well, yeah. if you do, no, I'll leave them. Yeah, you can open them. I like, don't know what happened to our He-Man ones. Yeah, because we got the He-Man ones before in a box. And, of course, this does this does say Nerd Block there at the top. Um, so here is the Ken. I believe that's his name, right? Ken? The long Ken, Ken or Ryu? Yeah, Ken. I can't I was, I was thinking I was doing some of... I was thinking of... No, oh, that's still Street Fighter. I don't know. So we have Ken... Then the Dalsim, I guess, is his name. Right there. And then Balrog, or whatever you said his name was, the boxer. Yeah. So that's cool. I, I really like these most things. I mean, I wish they um, were, like, their actual colors so you could, like, see for sure, like, who the character is. But with this, you have to look at it real close to, like, see their clothes and all sorts of stuff to see who it is. Um, but I still really like those. I think they're cool. We have an umbrella. A bumbrella. And I bet I can probably hit you in the head with it. Um, I don't know what it's of. Uh, it's obviously blue and silver. Let's see. Oh, oh we're going to have bad luck now. I guess you have to push it up. Come on. It looks like it folds. There's no button. There we go. Oh, it's upside down. Like we got caught in the rain. There. So it's got... XO... Man of War, whatever that is. Don't know what that is. I hope. I think there should. 
Actually, he's supposed to have a comic book on a free comic book day. Oh, so, apparently it's a comic. I don't see any tags or anything. There is a uh, C2E2 exclusive thing on the, um, whatever you call it there, the handle. Um, it's kind of weird how this folds up. So if you fold it up normally, it's then inside out. But if you put it the other way, it's in inside out when it's up. I don't know. Very confusing. But anyways, that's a cool umbrella. I mean, I don't know how well it'll do in the rain. And like I said, I don't think these boxes include um, like a book or anything. So I don't know if we'll. We're shooting in the dark is. here. People. Yeah. Um, so it looks like we have a bag. I was gonna say it was a um, apron, but I guess it's like a little tote bag. But it's got it says the Demogorgon from Dungeons and Dragons. Is what it's for. That is, I don't know anything about Dungeons and Dragons, but um, this looks, looks like a two-headed dragon. That's the so. Demogorgon that they showed in Stranger Things when they were playing Dungeons and Dragons. So, yeah, I don't know. I've heard of obviously the Demogorgon, like in the whole fantasy type stuff, like Dungeons and Dragons, but I don't know anything about. It. So that's just a, a small canvas bag. I mean, you can't really put much. Like this isn't like. Uh, like, there isn't much room, so I would say you can't, like, really use it for much of anything. Obviously, if you want to carry some, like, small item, I don't know. Put an umbrella yeah, sure in there. Something. Yeah, the umbrella you could stick in there. Um, we'll save this thing for last. Not that special, I think. But we have a comic here, and it's uh, the Black Cloud, it looks like. And it's, of course, a C2E2 exclusive. And it's from uh, uh, Image. So, whatever. <clears throat> this has never heard of it. Doesn't even look familiar. Or anything like that. So it's very, it's definitely like a paper cover, which are always dangerous. Um, we've got some weird creatures in and stuff. Don't know anything about it though, unfortunately. So I'll just sit that over to the side. And it looks like maybe one of the last items in here. Oh, we do have a thing. Um, we have a print, and it's, um, so it's this. And I'm not sure if this is anything. I mean, the characters somewhat look familiar, but I don't know. I said, we'll have to look at the thing here. Oh, it is who I thought it was. Is it Storm and Wolverine? Yeah, that's who I thought. It, like, it looks like Storm and Wolverine, but I couldn't really tell. So yeah, it's Storm, and, Storm with her mohawk haircut and then Wolverine. But I was like looking at the guy because like, it looks like Wolverine, but I was looking for like, you know, claws or something to like hint at that's who it is. But of course, this is a um, exclusive thing and all that sort of stuff. So it's a weird picture, like I said, because it looks like him. But besides, if you don't know that thing, you would know who it is. And I don't understand why they're singing and playing music. Yeah. Like. And like, there's no hint to them at all. Just their features is the only thing. Like, there's no storm or wind or thunder, lightning, anything really. The storm, and then Wolverine doesn't have his claws or anything. So. Um, still a cool picture though, and so now we do have a card. I don't think we had one in the last box. Oh yeah, I didn't show the very last thing. And so the last thing um, is the pin for the thing, and it, it's a hot dog. So it kind of, of course, goes with Chicago, their hot dogs and stuff like that. And it says C2E2 on it, 2017. So that's kind of uh, cool and stuff. So we'll look at the card now. So of course we do have the hot dog pin, the um, it's a C2E2 coat of arms t-shirt, the preview exclusive uh, Deadpool, um, it doesn't really say much of anything. It says, uh, it may be a different look for the Merc with the mouth, but it's hard to dispute that um, the new outfit suits him. Mm -hmm. um, then we have, an, of course, the Exo Man of War umbrella, which doesn't say much of anything, just that um, something about the Peru Peruvian jungle. Then we have the Black Cloud number one comic is what that was. And it says, from the qu creators of Spider-Gwen is who wrote that so there's that for you if you wanted to know we have the Demogorgon tote bag the of course Wolverine and Storm print I was gonna see if it says anything on here just says Chicago says performing at a local Chicago jazz club and it's done by Ramon uh, Perez which that name sounds really familiar I think he's a comic artist and then of course we have the Street Fighter muscles it looks like there was possibly four different packs that you could get I mean, they're all the same color and just ran different characters and stuff like that of um, the Street Fighter characters. So that's it for this box. So what was your favorite item out of this box, bro? 
Uh, possibly the muscle characters. Yeah, the muscles were cool. I mean, I don't know what's uh, my favorite. I do like the muscle character and stuff. Um, but I like, like, generally everything. I thought the shirt was cool. Um, I think the idea of an umbrella in a bag likes I don't know the quality of this umbrella. And I like the colors and stuff. And with Exo Man War, it's not, like, anything, like, super standout-ish or anything. Like, I have no clue what it is. So, it's not like, um, it's something big and obtrusive that would, um, cause, like, keep from using the umbrella or anything. Like I said, I don't know about the quality, though, of it. Um, so yeah, it's a lot of cool stuff. I, I guess I would have to say probably the muscle things too and stuff. Um, I was really hoping to get like a signed picture or something from, uh, C2E2 since it's a pretty big, um, Comic Con. I want to say it's probably close to the second or third probably biggest Comic Con in the United States here and stuff. But, um, that's it for this unboxing. If you enjoyed, please leave a thumbs up. Leave any comments you have down below and hit the red subscribe button to see more. And we'll see you next time. Hadouken! Thank you.